Hello everyone, this is Carrie from Celestial Forecasts with a reading focused on the Divine Masculine. Is your Divine Masculine crush crushing on you? Do they still desire you? So this is for those who are either at a distance or you're encountering some challenges in union. Let's take a look at that here, general as always. So please keep that in mind throughout this reading and release what doesn't make sense for you. I'm going to start with this deck by Angelic Revelation 144, the Fire and Ice Lenormand deck. All right, so is there some energies here for your masculine to give us an indication of them still being into you, still desiring you. Let's take a look at that here. Okay. Oh my gosh, beautiful energy to start off with the sun, confidence, courage, success, and happiness. And of course, in tarot, the sun's energies is one of the most positive cards. So I have a feeling here, this masculine, especially for those at a distance, regardless of the fact that they're not with you, when they think about you, it still makes them very happy. And there's this potential that you guys could still find that perhaps moving forward in the future you can still come back into union or at least be able to overcome the challenges of the partnership look at this next card right here we have flowers okay love passion and appreciation some of you might receive some unexpected flowers from your masculine and they're telling you here they still feel so connected to you the love is still here that's for sure they appreciate you the things that you've done the effect that you've had in their life in their heart so those are all very positive energies here let's see what else we do have the writer fast news or fast news or traveling to you okay so this is a really good indication that your masculine will be reaching out to you somehow or paying you a visit they might just ultimately show up at your front door with some flowers here and look at the next card eternal heart infinite unconditional soul love some of you guys might even feel this is a twin flame connection with your masculine and lastly we have bridges coming through i mean look at all of these images right here the intimacy looking into each other's eyes the closeness divine connection and shortening the physical distance to bring you together i love that okay so those are some great messages presenting itself there so let's grab some tarot here i'm going to pull from my tarot teacher deck which i have actually been using a whole lot lately and i'm actually working on another volume for the tarot teacher for those of you guys who already have this one and i'm actually going to be doing a volume as you can see it's got upright and reverse meanings but the new edition will actually have the reversed meanings in the reverse <laughs> so you know when you get it you're not going to actually have to turn it over to be able to read what it is so I should have done that from the get-go, but I didn't, so my bad. <laughs> but anyway, I am working on that. So if that, that's something that you would be interested in, I will definitely announce that probably more than likely initially on my Instagram page. And I might do a deck flip through video for my YouTube channel. So, all right, so let's clarify here. Clearly they are still very interested, desiring you rushing on you you might receive some flowers here look at this ace of wands guys all right so some of you guys could be dealing with a fire sign divine masculine or this is just letting us know that look at the flame the the fiery heat and chemistry between the two of you they want a new beginning they want perhaps another opportunity to create growth in this partnership i mean with the bridges card right there and I love how it says they want to shorten the physical distance to bring the two of you together. Okay, so that's actually really nice. Let's see what else here. But, you know, obviously you guys are either at a distance or, again, going through some challenges for a reason here, you know. So we do have the Queen of Swords coming through. And perhaps for my Divine Feminines you had to cut your masculine out for whatever reason and maybe this is just you being independent in the meantime and you've set up some boundaries around yourself to let your masculine know what you are willing and not willing to accept in the partnership 
we do have the temperance card here. Some of you guys could either be Sagittarius or your masculine is a Sagittarian here. They perhaps realize that in order to approach you, to come towards you, it's going to take time. They're going to have to figure out the proper way to do this, to be able to restore balance and the connection, because the temperance energy is tapped into having patience. And at the end of the day, what your masculine is wanting here, Divine Feminine, is to be a part of your life once again, to bridge the gap between the two of you, because you make them happy. Some of you might be feeling a little bit defensive with your masculine, even though you care for them, you are still attracted, you have so much love for your masculine. With that Seven of Wands, it can sometimes be indicative of competition that you had to deal with. If there was competition or other people that were vying for your masculine's attention, if there were issues with infidelities or secrets and lies or third parties, that could be part of the reason why you're just protecting your heart space at this point in time. But we do have the King of Cups right here. So your masculine is coming through letting you know they're ready to love you the way you deserve to be loved. This masculine right here is someone who is very caring and loving. You know, they would actually be a good candidate for a good spouse in your life. That is if you're interested in getting married someday. This is someone who's matured, they've learned lessons. This perhaps is a different version of your masculine from the last time that you guys might have interacted. So they definitely want a new beginning with that Ace of Swords. This is a breakthrough. This is the clarity that they've had. They now see things a whole lot differently from how they did when you guys might have been together or before you guys went into separation. Maybe they just didn't appreciate you for what you represented in the connection. They're making better decisions at this point, and they really want a new opportunity to come towards you to fix perhaps what was broken in the connection. Okay, so let's go ahead and add to this and grab some additional messages focusing on your masculine. I'm going to be using this deck by Fire Witch Tarot, Divine Masculine within my head. So let's see what other messages need to present itself here when it comes to your masculine divine feminine what are they thinking feeling or what is it that just needs to come to the surface right now i want to take you shopping okay this could be something that you guys actually enjoyed doing when you were together you know and as you can see from this photo that's sexy lingerie right there so they might really want to see you in something alluring and sexy i mean we we see the fire and the chemistry from the cards that have already come through look at this the intimacy and you know it's not just all about sex it's just being able to be together to hold each other to be able to touch each other and it does say i feel so comfortable with you it feels so right and it just feels right being in your presence. Okay, let's grab one more message here. One more message from the masculine. I mean, they're definitely desiring you. We see that here. I love it when you dress sexy just for me. See that? Okay, so there's the sexy lingerie right there, and here's you wearing it. <laughs> so they're definitely focusing on your sexiness, how alluring you are, how much they desire you, and really they're thinking about this, they're fantasizing about this, and they want to make this a reality once again. All right, so let's go ahead and grab some additional tarot here. I'm going to pull from my Tabby Tarot Teacher deck this time. But no doubt they're crushing on you, Divine Feminines. They still desire you. And they're ready to really fix the issues that either you're currently dealing with or issues that ultimately separated the two of you. And your masculine is recognizing how sexy you are. The Queen of Wands is very passionate and sexy and confident. And they're totally loving that you know, totally loving that. And your masculine here, they're really ready to come towards you. They're very curious as to perhaps where you're at on this journey. If you even think about them, if you're crushing on them and still desiring them, 
if there is no contact and no communication, they have no idea to know this. So perhaps part of that curiosity is for them to maybe text you or call you. Sometimes that could also be interaction on social media if you guys follow each other. And they would love to be able to talk to you. This is a very restless energy with that page. You know, wanting new communication here. Look at this. We've got the lovers card. We've got the sun. Okay. And then we've got the ace of wands. So again, they want a new beginning here. They want to be able to make you happy. You make them happy. That is what you represent. They want to come back into union with you. They can't perhaps imagine to be with anybody else but you. They see you as their ultimate lover. The sexual attraction is presented here. But it goes beyond just the physical with this masculine. They love you. They are very attracted to you, yes. But I feel the love is very strong. The connection is very magnetic. The chemistry is... It runs pretty deep between the two of you. And the lover's card always presents this person you're masculine with a choice or a decision and ultimately that choice i feel is to reach out to you is to communicate open up lines of communication for you guys to get the ball rolling towards working this out whatever it is that's keeping you guys at a distance or whatever the challenges are preventing you guys from having these intimate moments together okay they feel fulfilled with you you make them happy i feel you guys make each other happy and if ultimately what you're looking for here divine feminine is long-term commitment i feel that that's the direction that ultimately you guys are headed so it looks pretty good there all right so let's wrap it up with some final advice i'm going to pull from the lover's oracle deck here so let's see so yes, a big yes as far as how they're feeling about you, desiring you, still crushing on you and wanting you. When it comes to matters of the heart, there is no right or wrong. Every choice you make expands your understanding of love and life. Isn't that great? I mean, first of all, we did get the lover's card where there is a choice and a decision to be made. And this is something perhaps that your masculine needs to realize. You know, there's no right or wrong way to come about this decision to, to create movement towards you, Divine Feminine. Let's see what else. Time, okay? And it does say time, you are trying too hard, give it time. And this is also something that perhaps some of the divine masculines need to realize. That's perhaps why the temperance card is coming through, letting them know they're going to have to be patient. This is perhaps a slow process. They're going to have to tread lightly, do the right thing. And perhaps there's more healing here that's needed for some of you. We do have passion coming through, which I am not surprised to see that. A magnetic and seductive quality surrounds you at present. Enjoy it. Yes, your masculine definitely feels this very magnetic, passionate connection towards you. We have a message for you here. It literally says that. I'm thinking of you this very moment. Your love fills me with light. I love you. Okay, and bottom of the deck. I love that. Manifesting miracles. Your dream is soon to become reality. Trust your heart and continue to follow its guidance. So if this is a specific message speaking to your masculine, perhaps this is a miracle that they've been waiting for to be able to come towards you. And who knows, some of you guys might have had a very painful breakup and maybe there's a part of this masculine feeling like it could have been an impossible situation to fix. But, you know, there is a miracle on its way, a dream that can manifest. And I feel you guys will be able to find your way back into each other's lives. All right, guys, so that is where I'm going to leave this one. Beautiful reading, lots of great messages coming through from your Divine Masculine. And if you're interested in your own personal private reading, that info is down below in the description box. Please like, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys real soon. Take care.